Good morning, good morning from Chicago, the risk management capital of the world. I'm Alan Nuckman here at the CME Group with your morning market stir for Wednesday, October 15th. Good news, we had mixed markets yesterday. The markets did not sell off again, so we were positive in the mini S&P, up 9.5 points at 18.75. Had the Dow futures up 23, 16,255, and the Nasdaq up 13.5 points at 84.12, so the bleeding has stopped for one day. Currencies were quiet, dollar was up 21, 85.94, euro was down 17 at 126.54, Bonds continued their rally. Flight to quality up another 21 ticks at 142.22 yesterday. The big mover of the day was crude oil down almost $4, down $390 at $81.84 in that crude oil market. So some new relative lows there and some heavy unwinding. Gold moving the opposite way. It was up $4 yesterday at $12.34 and had a relative high at $12.39. So that continues to hold its gains up here. So after a positive day for once, where do the markets stand here on this Wednesday morning? Well, we're down. We're down 14 points in the E-mini S&P. We're at 1861. We're down 85 points in the Dow Futures, 16,170. And we're down another 25 points at 3786 in the NASDAQ. The dollar's steady, up three at 8597. The euro's down 15 at 126, sorry, plus 15 at 12669. Movement in the bonds again, up another 21 ticks right now, 143.11. New relative highs there in treasuries. That's pushed yield down 2.93% on the 30 year and 2.16% on the 10 year note. Crude oil is off another 95 cents at 80.25, and gold down $6 at 12.28. So to wrap up the current action, with two hours to go before the cash stock market open, we're negative once again. After a positive day yesterday, they're beating them down. We're down 14 in the E-mini S&P and down 85 in the Dow futures as we stand right now. I will see you early Thursday morning for your morning market stir to set up your trading day. Alan Nuckman here at the CME Group, where it all comes back to commodities.